Hey there guys, welcome to Dino's Vault once again. Today I am at Autologic Reno and I am thankful to my good old friend Mr. Madhu and Mr. Ranga for allowing me to review the recently facelifted Reno Duster. Now there is no doubt that the Duster's new look is killer but another great news is that since we now see a large population of car owners preferring automatic transmission given the horrible city traffic conditions, Reno now offers an AMT variant for the Duster as well. Now I keep saying this in my reviews that the once unstoppable Indian has now become the uncompromising Indian because we want the maximum amount of features and goodies and almost everything at a reasonable price tag and with the traffic woes becoming worse and worse by the day an automatic is right at the top of preferences for any prospective car buyer. The Duster was an instant blockbuster since it was truly one of its kind when it was first launched. Its amazing handling, superb driving dynamics, imposing SUV looks and relatively compact size made people fall head over heels in love with it almost instantly. Now Renault enjoys a rich heritage in and of itself that is more than a hundred years old. Named after Mr. Louis Renault and his two brothers Marcel and Fernand, the company was established in 1899. The French automobile manufacturer has contributed heavily to the evolution of cars by inventing the direct drive gearbox, drum brakes and the turbocharger. Getting back to our review, the Duster still is among the best sellers in its segment and the addition of an AMT or automatic manual transmission just makes it even even more irresistible. Now let's start out by checking out the new design tweaks. The old design had a universal appeal wherein it appealed to people of all age groups. I personally like something more radical and new age. So this new look adopted by the duster really impresses me. It looks more modern and sporty and the minor tweaks further enhance the overall visual appeal of the car from almost every angle. Up front we have the dual winged front grille that looks prominent and striking. The all new Hawkeye headlamps look stunning and carry the smoked effect. However, I would have preferred projectors at least in the top and variant. The Firefly fog lamps come neatly integrated in the front bumper. The front skid plate along with the powerful bonnet lines give it a thoroughbred muscular SUV look. Coming to the profile, the 16 inch gunmetal colored alloys look gorgeous. I'm so glad Renault went with this design of alloy wheels. It makes it look like a proper overhauled car. The profile is simple and elegant and classy. I love the carbon fiber type finish on the outside rear view mirrors. The prominent kayak roof rails lend the car a rugged look. At the back we have what Renault call waterfall LED tail lamps and they look amazing. We have the prominent duster branding on the tailgate. This along with the rear skid plate that blends perfectly into the well sculpted rear bumper completes a near perfect design that carries all the modern elements to excite the youth while also oozing sheer elegance and class to entice the elders. Getting inside we have crimson black interiors with orange accents on the doors and AC vents that add all the sportiness to the cabin. The three pod instrument panel is well lit up. The three spoke steering wheel is well sized and offers a good grip. We do get steering mounted audio and phone controls. We then have the 7 inch touchscreen infotainment system that offers mp3 playback, fm radio, usb and aux input, bluetooth connectivity, navigation etc. We get four door speakers in total all around that sound pretty good. Then we have loads of other features that really come in handy. I'm going to list a few noteworthy ones. First of course is automatic climate control. The AC is effective but we don't get rare AC vents. Then we have electrically adjustable and foldable outside rear view mirrors. We also get cruise control and a speed limiter. We then have the eco mode which as the name suggests would make the engine slightly less responsive to in turn increase the overall fuel efficiency. We also get tilt steering, driver seat head adjustment, rear parking camera with guidelines, speed sensing auto door lock, impact sensing auto door unlock etc. Getting into the back seat, we have sufficient room for three adults. We get more than adequate amount of leg room, knee room and headroom. Talking about storage spaces, we do get map pockets. I'm unsure whether it can hold a bottle in there. We do get a bottle holder at the back which is good. We also get cup holders up front. Then of course we have a spacious illuminated glove box. I feel storage options could have been slightly better by offering bottle holders on the doors. Coming to the boot space, we get 475 liters of boot space for all variants except the diesel all wheel drive variant which gets 410 liters of boot space. Talking about engine specs, we basically have two variants in diesel, the 85 PS variant and the 110 PS variant. This time I am reviewing the AMT variant which only comes in 110 PS variant 
gradient. Here we get a 1.5 liter DCI engine that puts out a max power of 110 PS at 4000 RPM and 245 Newton meters of torque at 1750 RPM. This comes mated to the magical 6 speed automatic manual transmission. In automatics basically we have two types. One is a CVT or continuous variable transmission where there are no fixed gear ratios and hence it provides for smooth and seamless gear changes. Then we have the AMT or automatic manual transmission which is similar to a conventional manual gearbox but the only difference here is that instead of shifting gears manually we have a control unit that does the gear shifting for you depending on the vehicle speed. Talking about my test drive experience I love the way Renault cars handle they make some of the best handling cars in this world the duster has always impressed us with its rock solid build quality amazing high speed stability and great ride quality so nothing changes on that front the AMT now makes things even more easier and convenient for the driver though the gear changes can be felt they don't rob you of all the joy you experience while driving this car the seats are nice and comfortable and do offer lumbar support the steering feels perfectly weighed at low speeds as well as high speeds the suspension is among the best in segment it soaks up the bumps effortlessly the amazing convenience that the AMT offers in the frustrating stop and go traffic is something you need to experience for yourself the AMT version also has hill start assist which prevents the car from rolling backwards when parked on inclines and on normal roads we get a smooth head start when we release the brake pedal. There is not much body roll apparent and taking U-turns is quite easy thanks to the shorter turning radius of just 5.2 meters. Braking is absolutely spot on and the great thing is that we get ABS with EBD and brake assist as standard right from the next to base variant. With the AMT variant we also get electronic stability program which is a life saving feature it prevents the car from overturning in panic turning scenarios like turning to avoid an obstacle etc we also get driver and passenger airbags in the top end variant Talking about other noteworthy specs, ground clearance is 205 mm for all variants but for the all-wheel drive variant which gets 210 mm of ground clearance. Fuel tank capacity is 50 liters. Talking about mileage claim, for petrol it is around 13 kmpl. For the diesel variants including AMT as well as all-wheel drive variants it is around 19 kmpl which is very impressive. Price ex showroom Hyderabad for the petrol variant starts from 8.68 lakhs and goes up to 9.48 lakhs. The diesel range for the 85 PS model starts from 9.48 lakhs and goes up to 11.68 lakhs, whereas the 110 PS model starts from 11.28 lakhs and goes up to 13.78 lakhs for the top end all wheel drive variant. So that's pretty much it for now. I just hope you found this video useful. Until next time, this is Dino saying ciao. Take care, God bless, and drive safe.